White abalone are an adorable marine snail. They're one of seven species of abalone in California, and they're apparently the most delicious, which is why we fished over 99% of them in 10 years in the 1970s. We took almost all of the white abalone in the wild, and there are probably only a few thousand left. My name is Kristen Aquilino, and I am the lead scientist for the White Abalone Captive Breeding Program. When I first started this work in 2011, there were very few white abalone at Bodega Marine Laboratory, just a handful. There were so few that we really couldn't do many experiments with them, and we were just hoping we'd be able to get them to reproduce, because no one had successfully reproduced white abalone in captivity in nearly a decade. Our first year, we created a few animals. We created 21-year-old white abalone, and that was really exciting, but it wasn't enough to save the species. And each year we've increased our production to the point where we're creating tens of thousands of new white abalone every year. One challenge with the depletion of white abalone through overfishing is that abalone are really terrible at long distance relationships. They send their eggs and sperm into the water column and those eggs and sperm have to find each other in order to produce an embryo. To save white abalone, we've established a captive breeding program for them where we take some adult white abalone from the wild, from the remnant population, bring them into captivity and spawn them and the babies we create will help repopulate the species. The things we're focusing on are really the kind of R&D of saving white abalone. Can we come up with the recipes to create as many white abalone as we can in order to save the species most efficiently? UC Davis Bodega Marine Laboratory is an especially wonderful place to do this work. We have an amazing array of scientists here with incredible expertise in the reproduction and development of invertebrates, in disease and ecology of abalone, and those people are really pushing the science forward. We have incredible facilities here at Bodega Marine Laboratory, really clean, wonderful seawater system, amazing resources to be able to culture large numbers of animals all at once. For the first time recently, we sent white abalone to partners in Southern California for stocking in the ocean. We've sent many animals to Southern California in the past for outreach and education, for research, this was the very first time that we sent any to our partners to be prepared for the ocean. I am so proud of the work that we've done here collectively at UC Davis Bodega Marine Laboratory. The people who have checked on these animals twice a day, every day of their lives for the past five or more years, um, the people who have maintained the water chemistry, the people who have made sure the grant money is flowing and that the shipping and receiving happens in a timely fashion, if we can make enough white abalone and put them out into the ocean, we can save the species.